How's it going everybody? Thank you for watching this video and just a quick note if you guys are subscribed or if you guys haven't subscribed yet make sure to subscribe and when you do click this little bell here on my channel and get all notifications sent to you from my channel that way you guys can be updated with all of my channel updates and uploads and whatever else I do on here. Thanks for watching. How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the source code. My name is Deshaun and today we are going to be talking about quickly what this advanced series entails. So a couple of things that we're going to go over is obviously some more advanced methods of doing things. We're going to um, touch base more on the details of things and not so much just getting things done. Uh, so for instance, uh, talk more about what like static means, uh, difference between public and private variables or methods and variables. Um, things uh, such as final, we're going to be looking at things like MR MySQL or MySQL databases and how to use those and implement those. Uh, we're going to be looking at Bungie Cord, uh, which is a very great tool uh, for especially for people who want to host game servers or create a, you know, just a multi-lobby, multi-server server. server. Um, it can be a great asset there. And we're going to be learning more about um, configuring your own custom server settings and basically trying to eliminate um, having more plugins and having less plugins that do the same thing. So learning about how to create your own plugins from other plugins in a way, if you kind of get what I'm saying. So like instead of having essentials on your server, which is terrible, you should never have essentials on your server, we're going to touch base on how you can create those commands inside of your, inside of your individual plugin to eliminate having essentials. Because for instance, on essentials, you know, a couple of good things are like the unbanned command, um, you know, the slash I, we can get any item. Um, you can create those sort of things on your own and not have to have, um, you know, the big giant essentials plugin, uh, which is a great big server and memory hog. Uh, so we're gonna be learning uh, a lot about that. We're also gonna be dealing with packets, which are a pretty essential part to creating uh, some awesome features and to using some awesome features that are built right into Minecraft. Uh, and lastly, we're going to be looking at, you know, N NBT tags, so learning about custom mobs and editing different, uh, you know, like things like chests and tons and tons of different things. So I'm really excited for this series. Um, unfortunately, the series does not start today. There's going to be no coding in this. You guys are literally just staring at a screen of nothing. I might honestly even just cut the, the picture off and just put on the source code picture like I did in the very first video. Um, but yeah, so I'm really excited for this series. It's gonna be pretty cool. Um, also with this series, it might not always necessarily be a tutorial. It might be, you know, one of three videos where we code a specific plugin. So like, let's say we make, a, I don't know, a war plugin. Uh, it's going, it might just be three videos of that. So it might be, it might say like war, uh, you know, part, you know, advanced, advanced bucket coding, uh, custom war plugin, and then it'll have like parentheses one dash three, and then it'll obviously have like episode whatever or whatever episode it is. So um, it's gonna be a lot of that too. So and a lot of like user requested stuff. Uh, I wanna do more of what you guys want. It might not necessarily be in in the advanced section. Um, so I might I might change the name of this series because um, it's not always necessarily going to be something super advanced, but maybe something we just never touched base on in the first series, or I might add it to the first series depending uh, what kind of content I think it really falls under. So that's all I got for you guys, and if you guys enjoyed this video, even though a little bit much to enjoy, uh, make sure to leave a comment, drop, you, drop a like, uh, leave some comments below what you guys want to see uh, me code and want to learn how to code. Um, yeah, thanks so much for watching.